many times that the U.S. is doing far better than any other country when it comes to testing. Yes. Why does that matter? Why is this a global competition to you if everyday Americans are still losing their lives and we're still seeing more cases every day? Well, they're losing their lives everywhere in the world. And maybe that's a question you should ask China. Don't ask me. Ask China that question, okay? When you ask them that question, you may get a very unusual answer. Yes, behind you, please. What, sir, why are you saying that to me specifically? I'm telling you, I'm not saying it specifically to anybody. I'm saying it to anybody that would ask a nasty question That's like that. That's not a nasty question. Please go ahead. Why does it matter? When okay, uh, anybody else? Please go ahead in the back, please. I have, to, I have two questions. No, it's okay. But we'll you go pointed here. to me. I have two questions, Mr. Next. President. Next, please. But you, did, you called on me. I did, and you didn't respond, and now I'm calling on Sorry, I just the young lady in the back, please. I just wanted to let my colleague okay. finish, but can I ask you Ladies and gentlemen, please? thank you very much. Appreciate but it. You thank you very much. Hey guys, just saw this, wanted to do a quick video about it. I'm amazed how quickly we went from that incident to everybody in the media now claiming Trump's a racist for asking Weisha Zhang to ask China. Something Trump has been doing for quite a long time now. I think he may have even asked that to Weisha Zhang before in the past and definitely other reporters in the press corps. So this is nothing new. So it really looks like the media and the Democrats are once again coordinating on an attack narrative for this week. I guess they're just going to keep laying it on thicker and thicker and thicker, you know, as we get closer to the election. One other thing I wanted to show you guys, it's kind of related. I just happened to notice on my Facebook timeline today that this picture I have posted, this meme of Trump talking about how it was the Chinese virus it, because it came from China. And I just happened to notice that Facebook had censored it. It says right there, false information checked by independent fact checkers. So it didn't come from China. Where exactly is Facebook claiming this virus came from? I just find it funny that they would censor that with a fact check and essentially create a new meme out of it. I've been wondering if I repost this in its current form, will they censor it again? Anyway, that's all I have for you tonight. I'll probably have more to say about this tomorrow, so I'll see you then.